If you guys are fed up of coming against sneaks like me and foot champs who use loans and OP cards from day one, I'm getting really sick of you! Get out now! Then you need to head over to MitchCactus.com where not only can you buy the cheapest and most reliable FIFA coins on the EA market, you'll find over 10,000 reviews from people who have used the services and enjoyed them in the past. So make sure to head over to MitchCactus.com and use code RECALL for 5% off. So guys, EA have just dropped one of the best icon picks we've seen all year, and I'm going to teach you how to get it completely free. So if you want a better team like mine and get some of these icons, you're in the right place. Just make sure to subscribe to say thank you, and of course, drop a like down below. So first of all, we're going to have a look at the SBCs that we're going to be using to complete this free. As you can see, I've done two out of the three sections. We've left the final part. I'll show you getting me the cards. Show you getting me. I will show you guys me getting the cards to complete these and how you can get these. Now, first of all, you're going to need an 87, an 86, and an 86, and ideally a high rated in form you want really an 87 8 or 9 so that this can be a little bit easier completed in terms of the other players around them now the upgrades you're going to need for this there's a few and of course we can start from the bottom and do this free if you invest a little bit in it's going to be easier but we've got the 84 times 11 so we can craft that we've obviously got the mixed league upgrades which can of course help us when we are doing any kind of crafting the 85 player pick unfortunately probably isn't going to help you it is a gamble if you use it for this SBC because you can put in a lot of 84s and potentially get out an 88 and 89 which would be good for you or a big inform for example but it's a very very low chance i will complete this to give you an example of exactly what it's going to look like the sbcs of course that you need to complete are going to be the daily sbcs your gold your silver and your bronze because they're very very limited to complete and what you get out of them can help you complete crafting upgrades now i've already completed all of the team of the year crafting upgrades but there are 150 of them you get free rare gold player packs for every single one you complete which i've got a load of to show you guys and of course, they're a good contribution in the first place just to get an 87s, 88s, higher rated cards that you won't usually see because it's untradeable packs. You do have some really good weight in them. So there's a good opportunity to get some of the fodder from there. Now, how you would do this essentially is build your bronze and your silvers. They're going to give you 44 cards. So you get 22 bronzes and 22 silvers. You pop them into your daily gold upgrade. Now in the daily gold upgrade, you've got two sections and you get bronzes and silvers back. So essentially, it gives you the cards to go and complete it again. So once you've got the end of this, you're ended up with 44 gold cards. Four of those are going to be rares. So you pop them straight into either the team of the year crafting or you can do it in a league upgrade. Now, if you're popping it in a league upgrade, obviously league upgrades, if you put in about 20, like 1,000 coins or even 40, if you want to make it a little bit easier, you can craft these for free, like unlimited. But you have to do that initial investment. You have to complete the SBCs. You've got to manage it correctly. Essentially, you are going to get different types of cards. These ones you want to sell no matter what they are, essentially, unless they're really key for one of these SBCs. And then the other ones, obviously all the untradeables, you're going to craft them back into either this SBC or your other ones. And of course, I do run guides on those and they'll be down below. Of course, you've got a video telling you exactly what to do for those as well. Now, the 84 times 11, this is essentially the most important bit. When you've got this completed, it's going to pretty much near enough complete, guaranteed almost one of those squads. So it's going to be 86, 86, or the 87. If you get an inform in this as well, that's absolutely perfect. Because it's an 84 times 11, obviously you are going to get stinkers. We, I know there's going to be people. I've had some stinky packs recently, even when they're like guaranteed a rating. But the reality is, it's much better chances that you're going to get a banger in one of these packs because you are just guaranteed more players. It is just that, you know, the minimum is 84s. If you get two or three 88s or even just a couple higher rated cards, you can complete an 86 rated SBC. Paco Bell arrived as we're cooking up the icon picks. And even with the 84 times 11, you also get a small prime mix players packed back as well. So every little bit you're doing in these SBCs, you are getting bits back. And by no means am I saying you're gonna get bangers in there, but every little helps, even if it's not a 10K card, even if it's just a few K here and there, you can put those players in the league SBCs. You're always getting stuff back. It's just how you use it. Just don't waste duplicates. I know over team of the year, we're also like conscious of that, but just don't do it anyway because it does help a lot. So before we pop open the 84 times 11, I'm just going to show you what the three times rare gold player packs are going to look like. Also, you've got these packs that you're getting coins back for as well that are also coming out of these SBCs. So you do get a lot back. It's not in like a, a bad position. It's just you've got to be, like I say, sensible with it. Make sure you're crafting everything back in because when you do that, you usually get a, a, a balanced return. I know it's not going to be great. Even from the icon pack, we asked to get stuff back as well. So I'll pop open three of these packs just to see what they're looking like. So even if we just get basic rares, we can obviously pop them back into the league SBCs. 284s is brilliant. So that's actually a solid pack. 84, 84, and 83. I do see, weirdly enough, like a lot of 88s out of these. So you do get some good fodder coming back. 
We've got, I mean, that's not great, but you know, not everything's gonna be a banger. We'll go for our final one here, what we got. We've not managed to cook ourselves like an import or anything, but another 84, it's definitely not bad. If we scroll along to the end though, we should see what our 84 times 11 is gonna look like. So we've not got an inform, but it's okay as long as we've got a double walkout. We've got Rodri. If it's a double with Rodri, that's sick. Okay, we've got Rodri and, I mean, look, we've cooked with that one. That's the whole, I mean, that would have been the 87 one really completed. We've got Lawrence there as well. We've got Rodri as a dupe, but that's fine. We'll go into the SBC. Do you know what? We've got, even with just those three, Lawrence, Benzema, and Rodri, I would have been happy with that, with like all 84s, but we've got a couple 85s in here. Do you know what? That's a brilliant pack. We've done very well there. Now, I don't want everyone to think that's going to be your pack because that was actually a really good one, but it shows how easy it is to get what we've got out of these packs and put them back in. But we're going to use Rodri for this one purely because we got it in there. And the chances are, I think we'll probably end up putting in a lot of 85s. It's only an 86 rated SBC. Um, obviously, my fodder situation is pretty dire. So hopefully, we don't have to pop in Renard um, or, or go and cop someone. Because obviously, like I say, fodder is bad. I've got a ton of packs that are literally waiting to be opened. I'm just lazy. Um, I probably should open them. Okay, so we haven't made the rating with that. What, what's it going to take to make the rating? Is 88, I, I, I presume Renard out for, uh, do, who would, Renard out for her? No? Okay, that's fine. So we can actually, Renard works. There you go, 84. Is that, yeah, perfect rating, right. So we've got a Prime Electrum Players Pack coming back. That's good. We'll take that. Now, I'll be honest, guys. I will do a giveaway. If we get a usable icon, I'm talking any position, even if it's going to be in my subs, I will give away 30 quid to have FIFA points. I don't think it's going to happen because it, my team is ridiculous. But I'll close my eyes. I'll click in. Right. First one. Owen. I've already had him in another one. That's not good. We'll go left. Ooh. Carlos Alberto is big. Carlos Alberto. I don't. I'm pretty sure Javi Alonso is nothing. Check is. That's massive, isn't it? Oh my God, Carlos Alberto is 900k. Okay, <laughs> boys, I'm not going to lie. I think he's going to take a centre-back slot from Walker because Walker has been there at the minute. That is incredible. So, unfortunately for me, I'm going to give away, was it 30 quid I said? I think it was 30 quid I said. So, we're giving away 30 quid worth of thief points. If you want to be in for a chance of winning, all you've got to do is subscribe, send proof over on Instagram. Oh my God. We've just got, this might mean I can actually do well in Weekend League. We've just got, oh, mate, my defense. I mean, if we got rid of Saliba and put in Walker, we could have a four fullback defense, but I'm not going to do that because Saliba is incredible. But what you want to do is subscribe and send proof to be entered into that giveaway. I will announce the winner, let's say, on the 15th. So we'll do it on the 15th of February. I'll announce the winner to that giveaway. Make sure to get entered. I'll see you guys in the next one.